A raft of wandering otters join us again today. We're on another mission. Um, we are trying to very safely, or as safely as possible, pick up some meds. We would have these meds delivered because they do offer free delivery at CVS, and I think that's very wonderful that they do that. Uh, the catch is is that um, these particular meds cannot be uh, delivered through transit. Uh, these meds that Paul are taking, Paul is taking, uh, and so anyway, we have to go pick it up, um, and that's where we are headed right now. Paul, uh, are, how are you feeling today? Funny. If you don't mind me pointing it out, I think Paul is feeling better. Yeah. We still don't like the um, quarantine, and we don't like the idea of staying on quarantine through April. However, um, we are dealing with it day to day as best we can. Right, Paul? Right. Okay. So, come see what we see. I'm not sure how much we're going to see today. Might give you a little after action after I go into the pharmacy. You may wonder why I'm not taking the camera into stores. Two reasons, okay? Number one, I don't want my iPhone to run the risk of uh, coming in contact with you know what germs. Um, the other thing is, is that I am trying to be respectful of people's privacy because there might be, you know, who knows what kind of things might be going on or things that people want to keep private. So uh, just trying to um, be respectful and respect space. Speaking of space, I want to emphasize again, the other day, yesterday or day before, I'm waiting in line to, uh, I'm waiting outside the door of a Dollar Tree and I'm six feet away from the door so that when that person opens the door they won't be too close to me. Well lo and behold uh, another person about my age, uh, maybe even a little older, is crowding behind me uh, like within a two foot radius. radius. And I'm like what are people think? Do they know what's going on? So safe space please and yes it terrifies me so the grin on your face that you were that I was terrified is not because I thought you could do me uh, well harm by strength but harm by germs yeah and I don't want to bring those home to my family so please everybody let's observe that space rule please what do you think Paul yeah yeah all right, here we go. Come see what we see. You know, I got to feel especially bad, badly for uh, people that are homeless. Um, by the way, speaking of homeless, I'm really not sure what the logic is of kicking people who are full-time RVers out of states like Florida uh, and other states and telling them to go home when their home is wherever their rig is. Just a little footnote. All right, so I just went into our local CVS pharmacy and I was able to get uh, Paul's prescriptions. And we are, so far everything's so good. Uh, I followed safe practices and uh, uh, safe scripts. <laughs> anyway, uh, uh, I followed safe practices and uh, we are out here in the park. And Paul and I, uh, we have a guilty pleasure. We like to, uh, well, all three of us actually, I've, a friend told us about a, an app called Old Time Radio, OTR. And it actually has all a, a uh, just about every um, old radio show that ever was. You can listen to on there. To me, they're as good or better than um, you know an audio book, and it's totally free. 
uh, you do have to listen to the commercials. And now all of a sudden, because we've been listening to Have Gun, Will Travel, all of a sudden Paul wants to try Winston cigarettes. So uh, he hasn't said anything about x lax though. Hmm. Or Don's pills. Or the other things being advertised on there. Anyway, a lot of fun uh, uh, hearing some of those old commercials, especially for Susan and I who grew up in the 60s. But, uh, oh yeah, his mother was 50. Yeah. Well, I was born in 58. So anyway, long story short, um, Paul and I are going to go listen to A Have Gun Will Travel. We call it Paladin. And um, and uh, as close to the ocean as we can get. The, the actual Marina State Beach, you can't drive in there. But we can park nearby there where we've done before and kind of get some of that salt air in our system, right? And some sunshine. And it really helps a lot. Yeah. Come see what we see. All right, well, here we are chilling. Well, um, turns out that we didn't have a chance to listen to Have Gun, Will Travel this time. So instead, uh, I had a long conversation with my sister. We're both optimistic about how this whole crisis is going to turn out. And we think it's going to end sooner than some people might be dismally projecting. Uh, anyway, not all of it knock on wood, but... Uh, uh, hopefully uh, you're keeping safe as we're trying to again we find it extra frustrating but hope everything's okay have a good one thank you for watching Raptor Wandering Otters see you in the next one